there are forces working on a descent, the same way the forces are working in cruise and climb. But there are some changes. These forces must remain in equilibrium. During a descent, students are surprised to discover that lift and drag both resist the descent. This can be seen in the diagram. Lift is acting to hold the airplane upwards. The drag is now acting upwards also, resulting in two forces resisting the descent. The addition of thrust counteracts some drag, which results in a shallower descent angle. Let's use glide angle to further explain the descent, and how it could be shallow or steep. 